Hi, and welcome back to Davis Sports Report. In this video, we will be discussing the viral sensation, Rachel Gunn. Rachel Gunn, also known as B-Girl Ray Gunn, has received backlash following her performance at the Paris 2024 Olympics. Some critics argued that her performance mocked the sport, while others defend her as bringing a unique and creative flair to the competition. Gunn's performance, which included unconventional moves like the kangaroo hop, and the sprinkler led her to losing all three round robin battles by a score of 54-0 combined, which meant none of the judges voted for her. This resulted in significant ridicule online, with some claiming that her approach disrespected the competitive nature of the event. The criticisms were particularly harsh, with some suggesting she used the Olympics for academic purposes rather than athletic competition, given her background as a university lecturer and her PhD in breaking culture. However, Gunn has received considerable support from the breaking community and the World Dance Sport Federation. They emphasize that breaking is about originality and representing one's culture. Here's what the Australian committee had to say about her performance. Breaking, like when you look for originality or innovations, you always search um, outside of dancing. Or not always, but uh, many times outside of the dancing, like martial arts, um, how the animals move or, or anything. And she was doing this to represent her country, her region, and she created some original moves. What has occurred on social media with trolls and keyboard warriors and taking those comments and giving them airtime has been really disappointing. She is the best break dancer female that we have for Australia. Ray Gunn is an absolutely loved member of this Olympic team. She has represented the Olympic team, the Olympic spirit with great enthusiasm and I, and I absolutely love her courage. I love her, her character and I feel very disappointed for her that she has come under the attack that she has. All who have supported me, I really appreciate the positivity and I'm glad I was able to bring some joy into your lives. That's what I hoped. Um, I didn't realize that that would also open the door to so much hate, uh, which has frankly been pretty devastating. Um, well, I went out there and I had fun. I did take it very seriously. I worked my butt off preparing for the Olympics and I gave my all, truly. Despite the criticism, her actions were seen by many as a celebration of diversity and, and creativity in the sport. The controversy has led to discussions about whether the criticism is fair and if the Australian Selection Committee should bear some responsibility. While some feel the selection process was floored, others believe stronger competitors on the world stage outmatched Gunn. Regardless, the conversation around her performance has sparked broader debates about the role of originality and culture representation in competitive sports. Share your thoughts and opinions in the comments section. And as always, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe.